Hi Cubs. So today we're going to be making school buses. The materials that we will need are a carton, any carton that you have in your house that's empty. It still has a little bit of juice in it. Um, some construction paper. And if you don't have construction paper, you can use plain white paper or any paper that you have and just color it um, all yellow because the school bus is what color? Yellow, good job. We're gonna be using glue. You can either use the um, glue stick or the regular glue. And scissors. And an adult because you gotta be careful with these scissors and you need a lot of patience because we're going to be gluing yellow paper or paper all over this carton. So we're gonna need a paper for here. We're gonna need a paper for all corners and the top piece. I already put one piece on because I had to make a hole um for the lid of the carton so i already have all my pieces measured for my school bus but um if you can get your parent or an adult that's with you to measure the pieces where they go so you're gonna need a piece for the bottom and you're gonna need a piece for the for the for the sides of the carton can anyone tell me what shape this is It has four equal sides. Hmm. Is it a triangle? Is it a circle? What is it? Yes, it is a square. And a square has four equal sides. Can anyone tell me what shape this is? It has two long and two short. Is it an oval? Is it a square? Hmm. Who said it? Yes, it is a rectangle, and we have rectangles on all sides of this carton. Um, so we have different shapes on this carton, and what we're learning with Mr. Nana are the cubic forms of, of the shapes. So if this carton, it's not just a rectangle, it's a rectangle prism because it's um, in a cubic form, right? So I'm going to start gluing on my pieces. Make sure that you cut out your pieces before you start gluing so that you have all your pieces ready. So I'm going to take my rectangle and glue it to one of the sides of the carton. Remember, you can use any glue, whether it's a stick glue. I think we're going to use a stick one today. It's easier. And we're going to glue all of the piece where we're gonna glue on our construction paper or paper. So we have one side. And it should look something like this. See, all covered. And then we're gonna go on to another side, take another rectangle, put glue, I'm going a little fast for the purpose of this video again, but remember guys, take your time so that your stuff comes out as perfect as you can make it. Try to line it up. And we have another side. Ooh, we're getting somewhere. We're gonna take another rectangle, glue it on. And the last side, because this carton has four 
faces. All right. There we go. And we cannot forget that bottom piece, the square. So I already have my square cut out. It has four equal sides. And then we're gonna glue that on. My glue is purple. of our school bus. Now we're going to work on the front. So I have, what shape is this? Yes, we have another rectangle. Two long sides and two short sides. So I already have one side here. I'm just gonna glue it down so that it doesn't drop everywhere. And I'll just glue it on the other side. Yeah, definitely the glue stick is um, easier for this craft. If you need help, don't hesitate to call an adult to help you, okay? Because like I said, this craft needs a lot of patience. Okay? All right, so there we have our... Um, school bus. I'm gonna put my last two pieces up here. That's two pieces. More triangles. I want this to be glued down good so that it doesn't show any of the carton. I want it to be a yellow school bus okay all right so we have a yellow bus now we're going to take a strip of black and put it just a tiny strip And put it right in the middle, right in the middle of um, our school bus, right here. Okay, so let's take some glue. Gonna put it right in the middle. And can anyone tell me what's missing on our school bus? There's two things. Who can tell me one? Windows. We're missing the windows on our school bus. So we're going to take, um, I took blue construction paper, but like I said, you can take white paper, or any paper that you have in your house and just color it, the color of the window and glue it on. So we're going to glue on these windows. easier for me remember to take your time guys take your time all right um you can also glue on some not glue on make some people once your once your school bus is dry you can draw people inside of the windows so that you can see that there's little um children going to school on the school bus 
Alrighty. And we're gonna put this. Can anyone tell me what this is? What shape is this? It has eight corners. It is a octagon. And the octagon is going to go in the front of the bus because it tells us when to, it tells other cars to stop because kids are loading or coming off of the bus. All right. So I'm gonna put it right. I'm just gonna put a little a little part on the corner. Uh, wrong corner. All right, guys. Sorry. All right. And then we're gonna put it right here in the front. Folded just like that. Stop your cars. There's people getting on the bus. Awesome. Um, if you want, you can put more windows on the other side of your um, school bus so that you know you have windows on both sides. And you can also put the black strip, but you don't have to put um, the stop sign because the stop sign is only on one side. What is next? What are we missing? How is the school bus supposed to go? What is missing? The woof, woof, woof. Who can tell me? I'll give you a minute while I get it going. What is missing on our school bus? What makes the school bus go? the wheels good job okay so i'm gonna put the wheels right here and, right here. and like i said you can put you can also put the wheels on the other side if you want so that you have um wheels on both sides and there you have it guys we have a school bus you can get an adult to get a marker and write school bus right on the front of your school bus hold on let me, let me try to make it a little darker so you guys can see it The final touch of our beautiful school bus is the middle piece to our wheel. Oh, this was so much fun, guys. My my I love how my school bus looks. And I love how your school bus looks. One and two. And there we have it. Our school bus. All right, guys. Don't forget to post what you guys create on our class tag so that I can see what wonderful creations you, have, you guys have come up with using your house um household products um and be creative remember be creative make it your own bye guys